Oh, what up? What up? It's me. It's me here. <laughs> I promise you, it's been like approximately one week since you guys saw last saw me. And um, yeah, nothing has happened. I've just been going to school. I feel like my lens is dirty. But please don't be dirty, yeah? So I'm sitting on the floor, as you can see. Hi, hi, hi. If this is where you're joining the vlog, hi, what up? I hope you're good. I, I hope I've done my intro. If I've not done my intro, forgive me, yeah? If I've not done my intro, hi, my name is Amara. Also, I'm a Nigerian who lives and studies in Germany. Thank you for clicking and I hope you do subscribe and join the family. I promise you, I sometimes look better than this. I've actually promised myself that I will stop looking like this on my vlogs. Like, what is this? what is this well that's by the way thank you so much guys for watching um what did i even want to say i wanted to say something today but i've forgotten yeah um i actually have good news i have good news guys i landed a gig like i don't know it's kind of a big deal but then it's not a big i well i think it's kind of a big deal sha so I'm actually shooting for a fashion brand um, next tomorrow. It's not like, I don't know, like, it's like a campaign and then we are looking for like just normal people to use. Like people, people can also relate to people that the consumers can relate to and not, um, you know, this model and, you know, the perfect picture of how a model should be and all that. So I got that gig and we should be filming next tomorrow which means um this hair is coming off today like today i am cutting it off it's actually long overdue you guys know i did not actually love this hair one minute uh okay okay i know even hi god my life has just been all over the place i did not even like tell you guys about how i was in um a television show and all that you know i promised to like give you guys a rundown so i feel like i'm just going to do everything today yeah and um yeah so what was i saying i will take off this hair today and then i'm going to make it tomorrow i don't even know what to make yet but i think i'm just gonna make like a ponytail you know and yeah i'll just get inspired yeah so um what else so we are going to go for the shoots they're going to give us the clothes to wear so we're actually supposed to get our hair done our makeup done but because i don't trust any white person with my hair i'm going to do my hair myself yeah um then makeup i'm still gonna go with some of my products just in case they do not have like my foundation shade and all that so i'm still going to go with that it's actually a morning stuff so hopefully i finish that and you know come back and get on with other things what else do i want to talk about um so let us talk about how I appeared on television in a fashion show, you know? So if you are following me on Instagram, you must have known this. Like, this happened, I think, two months ago, um, where my episode aired on television. So guys, you people are actually looking at a celebrity right now. People are actually beginning to recognize me on the streets or at events and it's kind of making me shy especially when i'm not dressed very well i'm like guys i'm not dressed you just don't come to me when i'm not dressed very well come to me when i'm dressed well oh but you see when i'm not dressed i'm like jesus christ who, who is that like i've had people approach me and be like oh yeah mara and all that i'm kind of shy like it makes me shy <laughs> it makes me shy nevertheless whenever you see me outside and you want to come and say hi just come and say hi i'm sorry i'm digressing so let's go back to how i got into this fashion show so this fashion show is called shopping queen yeah it's um one of like the biggest shows here in germany it's actually quite huge i don't know why i've kind of like been you know hush hushing it but it's actually a very big deal i swear to god it's a very big deal and i can only be grateful to god almighty for the opportunity for the exposure and for the experience honestly so this is actually what happened yeah i used to watch the show a lot back when i was in frankfurt and all that i used to watch it with my friend and my friend was like oh amara why don't you like apply i'm like me apply to go and do what to go and embarrass myself she's like no amara you can actually do it and i think it took 
one year after that before I applied and they actually took me instantly but then this was happening when I was in Unio when I was in Boku in that my small room the OGs will still remember yeah so they took me like I think I got a response within one week I got a response that they have taken me and all that so we are now preparing because it was actually close to the filming date um, so I had to let my hostel people know that there will be a team of camera coming and all that so unfortunately the like the landlord of the hostel was not very enthusiastic about it he said I would have told him like months ago I'm like dude I just knew about this thing one week ago how would I have told you months ago so long story short um, that did not happen because the landlord was like he cannot let a national TV into this hostel as it is right now I'm like so guy you know you're supposed to do some renovations here and you're not doing it I'm like okay I cried honestly but that was it and unfortunately I had to tell them like the production team that look at my um you know look at the issue and unfortunately I will not be available for the show so they're kind of so they were like oh it's such a pity next time when we are because this show is being done like city by city yeah so they do it like so it's actually a competition yeah it's a fashion competition and if you watched it you kind of understand what I mean but if you have not maybe go to my Instagram yeah I will kind of link the post here so go on my Instagram and watch like go through my feed and you kind of understand what I'm talking about here yeah? so they were like okay next time when we are in your city and maybe when you've moved out you could let us know so when so I kind of forgot about it so when I came here I like you guys know I've been living here for like two years more than two years now I kind of literally forgot about it, it was like last year ending of last year I was like am I ah why don't you like you know contact these people again but i didn't do it here yeah? i did not even go and um, i did not forge ahead with the plan so i kid you not two weeks after i had that thought they wrote me they're like oh am I, we are in your city again would you like to join us and uh, i was like yeah the thing that is i've actually moved out from that city i'm living in another city and um, i don't mind skipping this one out when you guys come to my city then i can join you you know so they were like oh we're actually coming to your city in two weeks time you see when god when is your turn is your turn nothing can stop it i swear to god nothing can literally stop it so then i was like oh wow wonderful then count me in so that was how the whole preparation started. I couldn't say anything about it because I signed an NDA. Do you call it an NDA? But basically I signed a contract saying that I cannot talk about it before, during, or even after. After I could like talk about it a little bit, but I cannot like divulge all the secrets and everything going on. So the shooting day came, I was so 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 happy shooting they came they came to my house they shot everything so right now that i'm talking to you guys they sent me an email with a download link to my own episode so yeah i'm, I'm kind of quite happy um the show aired on the 22nd of august so it's been like um one month ago that it aired and a lot of people have been writing me since then it's just very very wonderful i just thank god for this um or for the opportunity it was a very wonderful one week because we shot for one week from morning till night we are shooting so i am so grateful to god for that experience for even the the opportunity to be among this show do you know what it means coming out in the national television the whole of germany ah Bugao, eh, Bugao. <laughs> That's all I can say. Okay, I'm talking too much actually. But um, yeah, I think that is like life updates for now. For now, I don't want to talk too much. So I actually ordered food. I'm just going to, and it should be here anytime from now. It should be here like in five to ten minutes. So I'm just going to start losing these braids and wait for my food maybe see a movie so i don't want to talk too much the only thing i want something happened today guys that made me realize and i actually want to say this thing yeah if you know that thing you're good at if you know that thing you're good at if you know that thing you love doing and you know like that thing that gives you joy and all that thing you're doing now hmm, continue doing it Con like no matter just 
just block all the side comments block all the side eyes and everything looking at you because i swear to god yeah, when God wants to open doors for you, when God wants to speak on your behalf, it will just be like moving. Just that thing you're doing, continue doing because you don't know who is watching you. You don't know where your work is, is, is being transported to. You don't know in what room your name has been mentioned in a positive way, even if it's in a negative way, continue doing it. Everybody in that room, not everybody in that room will think negative about it, yeah? So... You do, like literally something the thing that happened today made me realize that just continue doing what you're doing in fact that is like the sh long that is like the long and short of everything continue doing what you're doing you don't know who is watching you you don't know who is going to contact you tomorrow you don't know who is going to praise you tomorrow you don't know who is going to say ah when it comes to this thing call this person this person can deliver even when they have said something bad about you just continue whatever you're doing i swear god will come through for you and yeah okay i'm talking too much bye guys um i'll show you my food when it gets here i'm actually very very hungry bye This is the food dance, yeah? So let me show you. I don't even like the packaging, honestly. Like, the packaging is trash, but let me show you guys what I got. I basically got what I always get when I order Chinese, because this is Chinese that I ordered. So let me show you guys. I just love the way it's... Oh my god! Oh, I actually ordered spring rolls, but I thought they were going to come like in small, small, small. Let me see. So good. Okay. I'm gonna eat this now. Like the packaging of this is rubbish. Then I have here sauce. I have here the coconut curry sauce. And here I don't even know what I have here, Sha. So here I have rice and here I have fried duck. It's basically what I always order. Whenever I order Chinese, so this is a yeah. See the rice. Can you guys see the rice and then the dog? Then this is the sauce to go with it. This is actually quite practical. Like I could reuse the plates. This is nice. Hmm. Hmm. Roll this big. Give it a try, make you know they shall I don't want nobody to give my mother care. For this love a day, I want to be celebrated. Don't wanna waste my days, I want to spend them on the enjoyment. Spend them on. I don't wanna know if you play me, keep it on the low. Cause my heart can't take it anymore. It's your fault. I don't fall for the bicycle. Hi, love. So, so. Good evening, this is me. As you can see, I'm flexing my hair. I don't know how to act every time that I get a new hair. Um, but this is like a me. Like, I did ponytail. You guys know that I love ponytail. By the way, where are my edges going to? Like, where are they running to? Guys, I need to buy a go-to wig. Like, wigs. 
so that I'll kind of let my edges rest and all that. But yeah, so this is the hair we came up with. So this time we decided to like have this. You guys know I love coils, like I am here for the coils. So we decided to like uh, do something like this. I'm showing you guys this now because after this, I'm hoping to the shower. And after the shower, I will just gently have my salad. Is that how you pronounce it? Salad. Sa salad. Salad. <laughs> okay, I'll be annoyed. So I'll literally just eat here and then hop into bed. You guys don't even want to know, like, when I finished yesterday. I finished at, like, I went to bed yesterday at 2 30. Can you believe that? So um, I have no strength. So I'm just going to, like, um, yeah, like I said, hop into the shower. And tomorrow is the shoot. So I need to get, like, my beauty sleep before then. This hair is so beautiful. Like, check me out, check me out, check me out. <laughs> I was going to remove that towel, but I beg, leave me. This is my house. Someone lives here. So I just want to like show you guys, you know, what it looks like from here. So this is it. I know. Yeah. It's perfect length and everything. I am so excited for this shoot tomorrow. I kind of asked them today, like, if I can do BTS for you guys. So they are still on the process of like giving me a feedback, but I'll still go with like my camera and then see what they say to me. Like if they don't want it, then I drop the camera. If they do, then you guys are gonna get like BS, um, BTS. Sorry, not BS. <laughs> okay, good night, guys. Bye.
Hey guys, so let me give you guys like an update here. Yeah? So I'm actually like done right now. We are done shooting and oh my goodness, the pictures you guys saw earlier, yeah. This um was such a very very beautiful experience. I had a lot of fun and the team they are all so lovely. Look at how beautiful I look. I mean you guys know it's going to be neutral or nothing, yeah. So um I'm about to just change, yeah. And then head home. I'm actually quite hungry. So I will show you guys where the picture will be uploaded. The picture is actually uploaded right now, like it's playing right now in the city of Dusseldorf. Like I am so happy. So I they say I should wait till like 12 o'clock that the pictures will be live. It is like um it's like a billboard something, you know. So I'm gonna show you guys, okay? I'm so excited. Yeah. guys so i'm actually home i know the amari you guys saw like on the last clip it's not the amari you guys are seeing now um yeah i'm actually home and i hate having makeup at home so i came back i took off the makeup i think i'm just going to end this vlog here um but i bought food see here i bought food to eat then i have like this um what's it called sorry <laughs> sorry my house is a mess my house is a mess. I've just been so busy and then I had to rush out today, but that's by the way. Then I have like this guacamole here. So I'm just going to eat because I'm about to have a headache right now. So look at who was on the billboard. Oh my god, someone should pinch me. Your girl was on the billboard. Oh my goodness. I am you can't talk to me anyhow right now. You must put respect to why I call you my name what what oh my it's so crazy like it's fucking so cr i can't even believe it god has just been so faithful and i am just grateful for the experience and everything so yeah next time you want to call my name put some respect like a little respect on it okay so thank you guys so much for watching this vlog um please make sure to subscribe like and comment like what are you doing if you're coming here to watch just for free and going that is not how we do it over here i look so different from your mind you guys saw earlier but it's also because this place is very dark you know like my skin is just i don't even know a whole lot is happening but yeah thank you so much for watching and i shall see you in my next video bye